so my name is Christian. People call me C here at Cyberbacker. And I'm the director of SMM Media Planning and Social Listening. In what ways has Cyberbacker changed your life? Cyberbacker helped me in many ways. So the first one I would say would be the weekly meeting with Greg, the CEO of Cyberbacker. So for me, it means a lot since I've worked before with a CEO. I may say it's few here in the Philippines to to meet uh, your CEO. But for us in Cyberbacker, we meet our CEO uh, weekly for encouragement, uh, for uh, tips on how to manage finances, anything that will help you in life uh, professionally. So I think that's the top of my list, how Cyberbacker helped me. Describe your life with Cyberbacker in one word. And can you please elaborate? It would be blessed or a blessing. So what my life before Cyberbacker So, my wife and I do have a job. However, it doesn't sufficiently provide for us. So, that's when uh, I took the leap and like prayed to God to resign and then ask for his leading. And then I came across on searching online jobs that I can work from home since it was the time when pandemic hits or the COVID scare hits. And... The first time I applied at Cyberbacker, it was a disappointment since I didn't pass the first one. However, I take that as a challenge. So, I tried to enroll in other courses or like watch videos that can help me grow. I found social media as an interesting path. If I recall, Cyberbacker has the night three months or 90 days so i just wait for that and then i uh, reapplied again then in god's grace so i passed the assessments and the interviews and all and then uh, i was uh, accredited uh, here at cyberbacker as a social media associate at first and then again in god's grace in his time i was promoted in span of a year uh, i was promoted as a director in social media planning and what I can say as a cyberbacker for me is a blessing and I am blessed to be here at Cyberbacker. What is your message for aspiring cyberbackers and those who are yet to discover cyberbacker? From a cyberbacker who did not pass on the first try, keep on in life. So it doesn't mean that uh, you failed in such uh, interviews in assessments you failed in life as a whole so maybe uh, god has something to tell you in that situation or in that position so think it as a challenge think it as a stepping stone or a fuel to boost you to motivate you since not all things will go in your way so i think that's it so look toward your goals in careers in and in life Good luck with Chopper Bad